students i hope you people are in the pink of your health i am here again beginning the first topic of english one that is the attic not wasting much time let us begin with this chapter and the first question which arises in everyone's mind is that what is an attic so let me explain that an attic is a small space just below the roof of the house it is mostly used as a storeroom people sometimes store those materials that are not frequently used in the attic so this story is about a group of friends who are not able to move out of the house and play as it is raining heavily so what do they do and how do they play in their play time let us know by reading this story rain 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 how it rained the great drops of rain ran down the glass in streams what is a stream when the little drops of water fall on the glass pane they move down in the form of a line that line of water droplets is called as a stream mohan afzal and little nuri watched it for a long time oh dear they said at last do you think it will ever stop raining we want to go out and play so let us understand what is given in the paragraph mohan afzal and nuri are three friends who are stuck inside the house due to rain they want the rain to stop so that they can move out and play but it's been a long since the rain has been pouring and they have no option but to stay home so let us read the next paragraph now mohan had an idea why don't we go up to the attic and play he asked the other two thought it was a wonderful plan off the other off the three friends went running up the wooden stairs with their noisy feet what does noisy feet mean over here let me explain whenever you climb up stairs and you stamp your feet hard it makes a noise that means you are walking with a noisy feet let us move further they found three old brooms and began to play soldier mohan first then nuri with afzal at last of all the attic wasn't very large but the children made space to play let us understand what was given in this paragraph mohan got an idea of playing in an attic they ran upstairs into the attic they made some space and found few brooms and they started playing soldier they pretended as if they were soldiers and marched down the attic they walked past here and there let us read further while they were playing afzal's mother was baking her special cookies for them downstairs her secret was that she dipped the dough in sugar syrup to sweeten it what does the dough mean have you ever seen your mother baking cake or cookies she mixes the wheat flour with water that mixture of wheat flour and water is called as a dough so she could hear them as they marched along she could even hear afzal's command about turn every time they reached one end of the room let us understand what was given in this paragraph while the children were playing soldier upstairs afzal's mother was baking cookies for them she had a secret of sweetening the cookie cookies by dipping the cookies in the sugar syrup while they were playing she was hearing the students marching along the attic let us read further by and by they were tired of playing soldier they pulled down some old dresses and hats which were hanging on a peg put them on and acted like grown ups then out of an old box they dragged a scrapbook full of pictures and sat down to look them over now let us understand what was given in this paragraph whenever you play 
you usually get bored by playing the same thing for a long time similarly these children were children were also bored of playing soldier for a long time so they found out a new game they pulled out some dresses and hats which were hanging on a peg they put them on and started acting like grown ups that means like adults after they were bored of this game even they found a old found an old scrapbook which was kept in a box and she, they took out the scrapbook and started looking at the pictures that were pasted over them over it let us read further and see what happens next in the meantime lata arrived Lata was Absal's friend. She was wrapped in a yellow raincoat and was wearing matching galoshes. She had bought a basket with two of her extremely lovable kittens in it. Absal and his friends are in the attic, said Absal's mother. So Lata ran up to find them. She did find them, but what do you think they were up to? All of them were fast asleep. After some time Lata who was Afzal's friend arrived home she was wrapped in a raincoat and was wearing galoshes below them what are galoshes galoshes are waterproof shoes that are worn over usual shoes so that the usual shoes can be prevented from getting wet She also bought her little kittens with her and she was thinking to play together with her friends and kittens but when she went upstairs she found that everybody had fallen asleep I'm sure Lata might have felt very bad Just think if you were Lata what would you do wake them up and resume the play or wait for them or go back home Think about it Okay that was all for this chapter I have few difficult words over here read them and learn them attic wonderful noisy downstairs depth dough marched command soldier galoshes lovable I also have an assignment for you all. The first assignment is to learn the word meanings related to the chapter that are given at the end of the chapter. And the second assignment is to frame a sentence with the words given below. You all have to frame one one sentence with the words which are given below. The words are kitten, plan, sugar, raincoat, cookie, scrapbook. I hope you people might have understood what was given in this chapter. I hope you people might have enjoyed as well. Keep doing the assignments, learn the difficult words, and yes, keep learning. That's all for this lecture. Thank you so much.